What's going on YouTube? Joseph Robinson. Hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, and knock the bell. Hey, listen up. You guys asked me about DMT. You asked me what my price prediction was. Hey, well, stay tuned, and I'm going to show you what my price projection and prediction was in accordance to Ethereum, BTC, and this whole billion dollar drop in the market. Stay tuned. What's going on, YouTube? Joseph Robinson. Hit that subscribe button. Bang that notification bell. It is 643. January the 12th, 2021. Hey, listen up. I've had some questions about DNT. Look, I'm not the I'm not the overseer of DNT. I just took a strong position because I believe in it. Now, uh, Derek, I think you asked a question in reference to what's the price prediction in DNT. So, I, you know, let's let's go back and look at something here real quick. All right, because DNT, it's it's it, it's kind of doing its own thing along with uh, a couple other coins, right? Uh, synthetics, uh, Civic, Loop Ring, uh, and even Decentraland uh, kind of follow each other, right? They, they correlate uh, with each other. Look, it moves, Civic moves slightly with it. Uh, even VeChain, right, moves together along with it. Uh, there's a couple other coins that uh, move along with it. Let's look at Loop Ring. Loop Ring moves along with uh, Filecoin, uh, Tezos. So the you know the syn synthetics. Uh, so these are these are kind of similar. Uh, there you go, right there, District OX. So you're going to see that, and of course, District OX is on the Ethereum uh, platform. Now, District OX is up 56% from where it was, right? Uh, trading in at zero uh, eight, even within a week, zero four zero five. Uh, I'm still holding for my initial position of 04. So now let, let's go over here to Coin Gecko. I want you to look at something really quick. Remember back in 2018, right? This thing here, if you can if I, bear with me on the chart, this thing was at 0.36. I think it went as high as, as, high as uh, uh, 48. You can look at the chart there. You can see where it went above the uh, 0 0.40 uh, line. Be still. Okay, so I, all I can go is this 0.36. So 0.3, look at the value. Look at the volume on that. 24 million in volume, right? That's 24 million in volume. Daily, uh, uh, that day volume. So as it dropped, look, look at this, look. You can see nothing is happening really. Two cents, three, nothing. 500,000, 300,000, 1 million. Right, there's nothing moving this thing. It's staying right at, it, I mean, even drop 144,000, 148,000 volume. There's no value. There's nothing pushing this thing. And that's what the market is about, volume and belief and, and psychosis, psycholo uh, psychology, right? It, it, it takes, you gotta believe in this thing. People gotta believe in it, put money into it to push it, right? You heard about Elon Musk where he mentioned uh, what do you, he, he mentioned something about a, a stock. People got it confused and bought into another stock. It wasn't even he wasn't even talking about that stock. Drove that stock up to a billion dollars or whatever. I don't know something crazy. Anyway, this is not about him. So DNT. Now look 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 here as we start to grow. Right, November third of this year, October. We got a little bit of volume. Right, it pumps up 13 million. Right, then it breaks down. Then it breaks down a little bit. But it's still kind of, it's still pumping. We're still in the millions, right? Thirteen. Uh, it's at five cents. Five cents drop back down again. Four million. Four. Still, we're still doing. We still got a lot of buying. We still got a lot of buying going on, right? And then boom, it just pushes up to fifty-five million. Now that's all. That's just about half, over half of what it did, uh, or double what it did back in 2018, right? So you gotta pay attention to that. And this thing doesn't always follow Bitcoin in the right direction. Like if it goes, if Bitcoin is going sideways, I know if Bitcoin is going sideways, it'll if District Ox will kind of be in between of trying to make itself back. If Bitcoin drops for a couple of days, then District Ox will, can, will start to kind of pump up a little bit. And as Bitcoin is going up, 
District Ox DNT is going up with it along with some of the other along with some, most of the other coins as well. But then as Bitcoin continues to go up, District Ox will kind of go sideways and then kind of drop again. So it's not necessarily dependent upon uh, uh, Bitcoin. I'm thinking more so Ethereum as well, because Ethereum should have been exploded if it was following that uh, Bitcoin uh, chain, right? It should, I mean, a thousand bucks, okay, 1100, okay. What about 3,000, 4,000, 5,000? Ethereum's gonna have to do its own thing now. And that's what we're kind of dependent upon, Ethereum taking off, not really Bitcoin. Yes, Bitcoin, but Ethereum needs to, needs to take off, all right? So anyway, now I'm telling you guys, look, so the price prediction that I have between uh, from now until the end of the year, we, we're going to need stability. We're going to need enough volume to push this thing to a whole new high outside of that 48. Because if, if it doesn't go past back 2018 levels, right? 2018 levels of a 0.36 at 24 million. And we just got to push up to 12 cents for 55 million all the way up. And actually that continued to push all the way up to what we know as uh, I think we went up to 30 cents. So we had enough value to push it up, but it didn't stay there. Why? Because people continue to sell, right? So right now, District OX needs to continue pumping. It needs to continue moving. People need to continue believing in it, right? And moving forward. So my price projection anywhere but from now to the end of the year is I, I'm going to put this thing at 35 cents. I, I think it's gonna. I think it's gonna stable, get stable around somewhere near 35 cents, between 18 and 35 cents. I just don't see. I just don't see it stabilize or stabling out at a dollar consistently until it hits new highs. It it could push up there, but I'm thinking it's gonna stable out and retrace right at 35 cents, anywhere between 18 and 35 cents consistently. Uh, to the year so who knows but you know the market is unpredictable that's just my prediction like it's unpredictable like we don't know necessarily know what's going to happen but we can we can do our best to try to try to predict it so i i'm just going to say that 18 to 31 cents that that's that's my price projection uh for this coin and if you're if you got in at four or zero zero four or five or six or whatever you're doing well you're doing well so I'm hoping that you are holding, uh, and of course, you want to take profits, take your profits. There's nothing wrong with taking profits. I'm just holding strong right now. And, you know, I'm looking at my wallet right now, 339,000 coins, and I'm okay with that. I'm going to stick there. But guys, do not get discouraged at all. You know, we're, we're looking at this market. Look, it's green today. I'm, I'm happy that it's green, right? And we need to stay there. Uh, District OX is up 56% right now. So, uh, 58% right now. Um, and I'm hoping that we continue to push up. But we need that volume. We need people to continue to believe in here. So, spread the word. Appreciate you, all you, all you uh, DNT holders. Stay strong. This is Joseph Robinson. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell. Hit the like button. Share the, share the wealth. Share the news of this channel. If you like it, leave me a comment. Y'all take it easy. Have yourself a good week. I'll be back soon. Peace.